Her three main interests, her children, her parents, and her God. Tonight, a grieving brother is speaking out. 39-year-old Anne-Marie Bouch, a mother of two who was gunned down on Milwaukee South Side on Monday. Her family says her situation was so bad for so long, her brothers and sisters tried to stop it. Fox 6's Myra Sanchik picks up the story for you. A brightly colored tribute sparkles on the step of Anne-Marie Bouch's home near Botsford and South 5th Street. Steps from where Bouch was shot as she sat in her van Monday morning. Her ex-boyfriend, Daniel B., her killer. Billings shot and killed himself in the driveway shortly after killing Bouch. As a family, we still love her, but um, ultimately, uh, he's a monster. Um, he's a coward. You know, he took her life and then shot himself. Anne-Marie's brother, Mike, talked as he drove to get other family members in Detroit. Mike Bouch says three years ago, Daniel Billings beat his sister so badly, the family tried to do an intervention. But his sister didn't want Billings to go to jail. The violence and the beating she took uh, put her in the hospital for um, a couple of days. Uh, broken cheek, two black eyes, her nose pushed in. Um, it was an um, ugly sight. Uh, she healed. She wore sunglasses. She went to work. She moved on. And she took the beating and said nothing. And um, we tried, but uh, it didn't work. Billings pled guilty to battery last year for beating his own teenage daughter. Mike Bouch says his sister was devoted to her children, a high school senior and an eighth grader. Her faith in God and church was growing, especially in recent weeks. My sister Annie, our sister Annie, is in heaven, and um, she made that decision, and uh, he took her up to heaven. Milwaukee police say as a felon, Billings was not supposed to have a gun. They're investigating to find out where he got one. Mike Bouch tells me he believes Billings would have killed his sister with or without a gun. Ted? Myra, thank you. And we need to point out, if you or someone you know is in a situation which involves domestic abuse, you are strongly urged to call Sojourner Family Peace Center or the Women's Center in Waukesha. All of their contact information is available on our website, fox6now.com.